talk about Purse Lane. Purse Lane. This is Purse Lane, and it is considered by many to be an obnoxious weed that grows out of the cracks in sidewalks and takes over your nice green lawn. However, today we're not going to look at the negative side of things. We're going to look at the positive, and we're going to look at its positive culinary benefits and refer to this as a succulent herb. Hi, I'm Annette, a plant-based home chef and a volunteer with Bounty and Soul, where we connect, share, and celebrate nutritious food. We believe food is medicine and we believe in the power of plants and whole foods. You see, purslane is actually a nutrient-dense green leafy vegetable that can be eaten raw or cooked. It's high in omega-3 fatty acids, contains a lot of vitamin A, C, B, magnesium, calcium, potassium, and iron. All in all, purslane is very is a very healthy, nutrient-dense, succulent herb that you can add to your diet. So last week at Bounty and Soul, I got a lot of a big bunch of purslane in my market box. In my market box along with some tomatoes and parsley and onions, lettuce, and some peppers. So I'm gonna use all of those ingredients today and I thought it would be a perfect time of the year to share my purslane and tomato cucumber salad. So let's start making the salad. So here are some of the ingredients that we're gonna be using today in my salad. First, I have some lettuce, I have a, a yellow bell pepper, um, I have some parsley, some radishes, and I got all of these items in my market box from Bounty and Soul last week. I got the tomatoes as well from there, and I'm going to be using uh, English cucumber. I'm going to be adding some walnuts to it, and then, of course, the purslane. Now, our dressing is going to include, oh, and I'm going to be, I'm sorry, I'm going to be also be adding some olives to it as well. So. Uh, for our dressing, I'm going to be using some some vinegar. So this one happens to be a raspberry um, vinegar, and I'm going to be adding some Dijon mustard to it, as well as some agave syrup. And we're just going to put together a real simple dressing for the salad. As far as the purslane goes, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be taking off these little leaves right here, and I'm going to I'm not going to be using the stems. I'll save the stems and compost them or something, but I'm, today in my salad, I'm just going to be using the leaves off of this. So I'm going to go ahead right now and take off all these leaves and um, put them into my salad bowl over here. So you can see that I have a good amount of purslane here that by just pulling off the leaves, I have a little bit of the stems in there, but that's that's okay. I'm going to go ahead and add this purslane now to my um, to my lettuce, my salad mix. And I'm going to go ahead and add the parsley to it as well. I just pulled off, you know, the leaves of the parsley. I only had a little bit, but I thought it would be good to add them to, to use it today in the salad. And now I'm going to add my bell pepper that I cut up, the yellow bell pepper. Um, I just think it's really pretty and it tastes good. <laughs> so I'm going to add that in there as well as the radishes that I cut, that I got from my market box last week at Bounty and Soul. Put that in there. And now I'm going to add the tomatoes. I'm also going to go ahead and add the cucumber. 
So this is kind of like my own uh, version of a of the salad, tomato and cucumber salad, purslane, using purslane and lettuce. So you start off with the base, a lettuce base, and you can add the purslane to it. And you can basically add anything that you like. So, I am now going to go ahead and make our dressing. I'm just going to use the same bowl that I used for the tomatoes. I'm going to go ahead and add some Dijon mustard, about two tablespoons of Dijon mustard. Um, I'm going to go ahead and add some of that raspberry um, vinegar that I have. Oh, it looks really good. And I'm going to say about a quarter cup or so. Whisk it up. Let me taste it. I'm going to add some agave syrup to it. I'm going to add some agave syrup. Probably a tablespoon or so. Taste that. Mm, very fruity. and sweet at the same time. It's nice. That's our simple dressing for the salad. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put the dressing onto the salad. Looks good. And you know what? I forgot about the olives, but I'm going to add those olives now. There's our olives, a little bit of olives there. And last but not least, I'm going to add those walnuts. I think the walnuts will go good with the, especially with the dressing and everything. And now I'm going to plate it and give it a taste. Here's my salad. Doesn't it look great? I'm going to go ahead and give it a taste. I'm going to get some of that cucumber and tomato, the bell pepper, the radish, and purslane. Mmm. 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 Very good. Um, the olives, the salty olives and the walnuts make a crunchy, great add to the salad a lot. They, they make a great addition to the salad. The dressing is really simple, no oil. Tastes great. And it's great for the summer. It's a warm summer day here. I thought I'd do my video outside. And it's great. Mm-hmm. Give Purslane a try. I hope, like, I hope you like this recipe and we'll give it a try. And I want to thank all my wonderful subscribers. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and subscribe. Click the bell, and that way you'll be notified every time I post a new video. 
one more thing. Don't forget to check out my cookbook, which is available on Amazon right now. It's called Heart Healthy and Feeling Full Cookbook. And the link to it is posted below in the details. I just need you to go out, buy the book, and start using all the wonderful recipes inside. Thanks for watching. Join me each week here at my home, whether it's inside in my kitchen or outside on my patio. But join me each week as I share plant-based nutritious recipes with you. And I'll be seeing you at Bounty and Soul each week as I hand out the local produce and wish each one of you the best. This is Annette signing off for now. And remember to invest in your health by eating whole, unprocessed foods.